What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, Mr. Enemy, welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's staying safe. It's been a few weeks. I know, I'm fucking useless. Uh, I've actually not been very well. The missus is called Virus, gave it to me. That's wonderful. Um, I lost my voice and uh, it's just been fucking a rough one, you know what I'm saying? So, but we're back. And also, before I get way too much in this video, don't forget my Discord, because we're always over there chatting about the game, learning new stuff, terrorising each other, stuff like that, you know what I mean? So come and join, link down below, come and join the family, make new friends, etc, etc. Also, I will mention, today or tomorrow, I'm actually bringing you a new game to the channel. The Legend of Mushrooms, brand new out this month. I've been playing it over the weekend, it's actually pretty sweet, uh, but I'll be bringing new videos to that, so keep an eye out for that one coming. Okay, what we have for today, today, a lot of people have been asking me about this. Lily's video bombing me, she knows I'm making videos. Fucking love her. Um, Mr. Random, it's been a long time coming, hospital capacity. How do you increase your hospital capacity? What kind of setup do you have in your castle? I'm using this castle today because it probably has the best hospital capacity out of all of them. Uh, just as a current standing in the kingdom, no buffs, it's at almost 11 million. On a KVK, I can get 117. Excuse the extra couple of zeros because that is uh, from the, what is it, the Ramadan event? I think I can get about 20 million with the, with the extra 100 million buff, 120, which is just like, woo, too much fun. So what I'm going to do is talk you through the setup that I have in my castle. Um, it might be a bit of a long video, so uh, you might want to sit down for this one. I might babble a little bit, but anyway. Let's get straight into the video. So yeah, current standard hospital capacity, it's all right at the moment, it's almost 11 million. It needs work. My hospitals are only prestige five. This is like my little bait castle that I fuck around with. It's, I play Archer over here. Uh, I've really enjoyed it. It's actually a lot of fun. Um, obviously I play infantry um, on this one, etc. over here. Oh, where's my avatar gone? It's a bit weird. Anyway, yeah, so hospital capacity, babbling, babbling. Top of the shop, what I'm going to do is show you the four heroes that I use. Two on the Doctor, and then obviously two recruitment heroes that actually add an increase to the hospital capacity as well. And I will talk you through that. <sighs> so, and again, I apologise. I'm still a little bit bunged up recovering from this virus. Oakley doakley. Starting off, we have Doctor number one. And the equipment you can obviously see on here is the rebirth set that I've got. And that's a plus six. I can boost it up to a plus eight, and it will actually, if I get it all the way up to a plus 10, I'll get another 60% hospital capacity, which is crazy, um, but that is obviously something that I'm going to be working towards, so bear that in mind when you're looking at this hero. Another little added bonus that I need to be doing is the fifth star on here. Excuse me, a little bit bunged up. We also get current hospital capacity 20%, so that's another thing that I'm going to be working towards that's going to boost up my hostile capacity. And that's just on this hero. So like I say, I've got the reef burst set on here and we've got the max gems of hospital capacity, 37.5%, five zero. Coming across here, we've got these gems here, the hospital cap ones that is 6,250. And when I'm talking about this one in percentages and plus, you'll sort of figure it out when you look at it if you didn't already know about this anyway. Um, you know, there's a difference and I'll basically show you. So that's a, these are plus onto the hospital cap, like plus a thousand, not plus a thousand percent, if that makes sense. Okay, and we're going through and then the hospital capacity, etc., etc. You can pop more on there for the extra plus, and then these stuff is just like healing speed that I'm not really that fussed about at the moment, working on, etc., etc. That itself, I ain't gonna try and pronounce this name because I've no idea. Uh, Diren, oh, fuck it, Derenjai. That's my one of my hospital capacity. I'm um, sorry, one of my hospital heroes. Number two is do do do, do this person right here, Tak uh, <laughs> Takenda Shiganaru, whatever his name is. Okay, and as you can see, it's pretty much exactly the same getup that I had on the last hero. And as you can see here, the rebirth set. If I push that to plus 10 as well, I'll get another 60%. Fucking crazy. You can see where uh, people get their hospital cap cap their caps from. And as you can see from here, going through hospital cap on the ring, hospital plus on the boots, 
and then hospital capacity on the uh, pants as well and then same across coming across here those are my two obviously again i get another 16.25 percent if i get this hospital capacity up as well which is just a another decent boost um and again i think i mentioned about getting the to plus 10 you can also pick up the hospital capacity here those two are what i use on this particular castle for uh my hospital heroes now coming across to let's have a little look so if we go over to the wall right and check out the doctors You'll notice in there, there's certain stats, obviously healing speed, blah, blah, blah. But we're talking about hospital capacity today. We go looking and what do we have? Uh, increased hospital capacity, 715.7% plus 137.3 from the original attribute. Now, what you also need to be aware of is that you can actually increase, if you didn't know this, <clears throat> excuse me, your hospital capacity right here. Now, when I say that, I was going to point to you. But it's very easy just to do this. This particular section right here on your hero position on recruitment, you'll see an increase of hospital capacity. And this is what I'm going to talk you through right now. So coming across to the two heroes that I had in the recruitment section. Okay. Top of the shop, we've got Jared. Now on here, I don't have the rebirth set because this is also a training hero. I have the gold Aurora set. But what I can do is actually add on gems. Whoops, sorry, wrong one. Um, of the plus, as you noticed on here, it's not percentage, it's plus. Do you see what I'm trying to say? So what I can do is add the gems on and put it in there. And that will increase my hospital plus. Actually, I need to boost that one up. Do I have a better one? Near, never mind. Okay, so there's something I need to. I didn't realize that one was so low. <clears throat> plus, what you can do is pop on I'm, i swear this works who has it said to me that i oh, know it was in the hospital uh increased hospital capacity because it's plus down here on my uh unity and banner amulet thing that i picked up and that increases the hospital cap you can go through and change that if you want like you know change it but uh also have like a little bit of training speed and other stuff that goes on there as well because it's uh better for this castle that covers that hero. Obviously, um, you know, there's certain stuff on the Aurora set that will help, and some of it won't, basically, at the end of the day. Um, there is a hospital cap cap, cap here. You see that of 1700, uh, 17,700. That comes on the equipment. Hospital cap, 35,400. Hospital capacity, 17,700. And the hospital capacity of 17,700. You see what I'm saying? So the Aurora set brings hospital cap on a plus basis, not on a percentage. That's why it belongs on your recruitment hero. Okay. And coming across to my second recruitment hero. I fucking lost it. Where is it gone? Do, 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 do. Uh, oh, yeah. Burn it. Now, I don't quite have a gold set on this one. And I still need to do a little bit of work on the gems. Um, you know, it all takes time. But what I will also mention to you is exactly the same set. People may say to me, Mr. Random, how the fuck do you get them gems? Okay, come over here. I was going to mention this in a video. Refine. Come across here like so. Pick the gem you want to try to refine. Left hand side, plus. Far right hand side, percentage. Press OK like so. 149 i've got the gem hit which here as well so it's cheaper refined like so oh fuck you game anyway i didn't well i didn't really need one of them so that's how you get them gems um i've got many videos on my channel talking about refining gems and shit like that so if you were unaware of how to get them gems that is exactly where you get them from Okay, so last, coming back across to my little recruitment hero. Now, obviously, the set itself is mainly, uh, you know, I do get a small hospital capacity there of 20,000. You see that from the evolution. Forgot to mention that on the Aurora set. But like I said, with the recruitment heroes, when you're trying to increase your hospital capacity, what you are looking for is the plus. So plus 1,000, plus 20,000, plus 30,000. If it's got the percentage next to it, it ain't going to work and you better put it on the doctor. You know what I'm trying to say? Okay. Other than that, a lot of it is based on just increasing science. There are a bit of science and stuff. That's not a big, you know. 
I really wanted to just cover the gems and heroes and stuff like that. I don't have anything set up for hospital cap on my dragons. Don't see the point at all. All defensive stats or attacking stats that I need. Nothing for hospital cap. Maybe I'll make a video about dragons, etc, etc. Need to push my hospitals up to a P5. Like I said, this is a bit of a bait castle. It's only a Lord 56. Um, I have a lot of fucking fun on it, put it that way. But yeah, I need to push up these to prestige. Oh, I mean, I've got some badges. I could do that. It's not a big increase. Um, but every little counts when you're trying to increase that hospital, their hospital capacity. Do you see what I'm trying to say? So yeah, other than that, I don't have anything set up on my you no know, dragon glass or anything like that. It is all a case of full combat out and then all the science and all the heroes done to try and increase my hospital capacity. Don't bother with the red dragon. Some people put the red dragon on to get the extra hospital. Don't bother with that. The two defensive dragons I use, personally speaking, are those two right there. But I can make a video about that and talk you a little bit through it. Other than that, I think that pretty much covers it. Um, like I say, it's more just a rough guide of how to just set your gems up and your heroes and what I've got. Because a lot of people have been asking me. Um, I can't talk you through completely your castle. Only you know what's there. But I hope some you can, you can replicate what you've seen here. And add it to your castle at the end of the day. Other than that, my name's Mr. Random. Hope you enjoyed the video. Slap a thumbs up. Like I say, Legend of Mushroom coming soon to you. And obviously, I'll be bringing you more videos now that I've got my voice back, etc, etc. Stay safe. Subscribe to the channel. Join the Discord. Love you loads. And I'll catch you peeps uh, later.